All right, the list. Extra conductive wire, two X70 chips, 40 square yards of synthetic, and a new charging pad. That should be everything. What on earth is that in the alley corner? Oh my god. That's a... Wow. Really, really rare. Excuse me. Hello? Are you alright? Oh, I see. You're in low power mode. Hold on. I've got you. Here. Good morning, R-400. Status? I see. Yes, your battery's just about drained. We can leave explanations till later in that case. You require assistance. I can help you. Stand up. My place is just around the corner, past the store. You'll be safe there, I promise. Don't be afraid. This way. Here, let me get you on the charging pad. Right here. That's better. All right. Now that you're charging, you should be able to respond to my questions without fear of shutting down. R-400, do you have a name? Yes, I, I know your designated model number is R-400, but you look like you belonged to someone. People usually give their androids names, and I just wondered if your people had given you one. If you have a name and you like it, I'd be happy to call you by it. You don't know? You don't remember? Have you been manually reset? You have. By a technician, I assume. Do you know their operating number? I'd like to have a chat with them about leaving androids out in alleyways. You. You weren't reset by a technician. By a family member? Why on earth would your family reset you? Oh, I see. A family member of your person. Well, R-400, you have some significant outer damage to your skin. I can only imagine that you probably have some circuitry damage as well you haven't been well taken care of. It's hard to accept that your extended family would put you out on the street with your main memory blocked and wearing nothing at all. I'm very sorry that you're going through this, but I promise I will do my best to help you. First of all, while you are charging, would it be alright with you if we get this damaged skin off you? It doesn't really look salvageable. And I just picked up a lot of new smart synthetic. We could get this new skin on you and program it to look just like your old skin, but without any damage. Would you like that? All right, let's get this off you. And then once I've run diagnostics on you, we can see about recovering your memory and finding out what happened to you. If you would like to return to your person, I will help you do that. If you don't want to, well, you can see I have a robotics lab here. I'd be glad of your assistance if you don't want to return to your old home. I could always use the help. Well, I rescue androids, repair them, and try to make them run even better than they did before. Isn't that obvious? Aside from that, I do custom upgrades to owned androids, and I'm also working on a personal side project. That'll be a major upgrade to the technology everyone is currently working with. But enough about that right now. Let's get the skin off you. Are you ready? Here we go. 
Ah, uh, there. Now, time for diagnostics. You stay on the charging pad, please, and I'll start up the process. We'll just let that run in the background. While that is going on, I'd like to connect you to a monitor so I can see the details on your reset. Would that be all right? Well, I'm asking if it is all right because I respect your opinion. Not everyone I see who has been reset wants their old memories back. Yes, once you have them, I can reset you again if you decide you want that. The only problem is that then you won't know why I did it, and you might get curious and we'd be right back where we started. No, I've never had that happen before. Whatever gave you that idea? <laughs> of course I'm kidding. You sure? All right. I just need to plug this in right here in your temple. Here we go. It says here your reset was performed a couple of days ago. Yes, I see the person's name, but I don't suppose it would mean any more to you at this point than it does to me. Looks like a standard pack up the memories and lock them away reset. There are no commentary notes to show why it was done. What I do have here are the memories you've made since the reset. Oh no. I I'm sorry, I was just reading through these. It says that after you were reset, you were stripped naked and... I'm sorry, I can't imagine how difficult this must have been for you. Someone took you out of the building and... Yes, I can see the rest of it. R-400, I'm so sorry. They put you out for the trash. You had enough power left to leave yourself a turn-on message, and you reactivated about 12 hours later. Being in low power mode, you couldn't move quickly, but you got yourself out of there and tried to find somewhere safe to go. <sighs> but that jerk didn't care. They wiped everything, even the emergency shelter locations. You couldn't have found anywhere to go. So, after you wandered for a bit, you just gave up. You were about to shut down for good when I found you. That's terrible. Um, are you sure you want me to restore your memory? Someone who did this to you may not be worth remembering. Hmm, all right. I'll do it. You may want to sit down on the charging pad. Sometimes this can be a bit of a jolt. No? Your choice. Here we go. Careful!